I spent many a days in Tiger Stadium watching the Tigers play. Uh, I spent a lot of time there and, uh, when they won the world, the year they won the World Series in '68. Uh, we used to catch the Grand River bus to Tiger Stadium. I remember Dick McAuliffe, Norm Cash, Al Kaline, Willie Horton, Earl Wilson, Gates Brown. I mean, these are guys that were Bill Freehand. These were my idols when I was playing Little League Baseball in the Sandlots of Detroit. As Detroit's African-American community continued to grow, the Tigers finally began inserting black stars into the lineup. Willie Horton, a product of the city's housing projects, came to the corner in 1963 and stayed 15 summers. Well, I like the Tiger Stadium. It's a very close, family friendly park. You're close to the fans. You feel like you can hug them all the time. I love in left field fans throwing balls to the kids and talking to the fan next to the dugout. Uh, and I love the ground crew. Ground crew came very good part of my life back up and under the center field where they used to bring the batting cage out. I used to go up in there and I used to cook barbecue for the bat, uh, ground crew back there. I remember one time, <coughs> excuse me, uh, they called the city fire department the first time we cooked and they didn't know where all the smoke come and we back there cooking reels back there for the ground crew. The smoke that drifted past the park during a Sunday game in July 1967 was not a false alarm. It signaled a city on fire as decades of smoldering tensions in the inner city exploded into flames. I remember 1967 winning the ride, and uh, I remember when they came in to, to ball, uh, uh, ball Park and they shut us down, told us go home for our safety. I end up person in my uniform on 12th Street you know, trying to talk to people sitting on cars. And I went back down there a few days because that's part of me. That was part of my paper route. I mean, I went to school. That's where I raised up at. But we as a team, I think we know and we're trying to set example how we was a family, how we work together. And I, and, I, and I make that statement. I believe that statement. I think God brought us in a certain period of time together, the place so long, we helped, we was there for that one particular moment and for that year or two to help cure our city. Uh, was a healing place after the riots in Detroit in 67. Uh, I remember uh, Willie Horton going into the neighborhood and the community trying to rally folks and use his status as a major star in this town. People like Gates Brown and other uh, African Americans who were playing for the Tigers trying to rally the community around a baseball team. And the following year in 1968, I mean, there was a whole lot of hope and a whole lot of unity because of the Tigers winning the World Series. So the ballpark was a unifying force at that point. For all the good vibes the stadium generated, it wasn't too long before the corner became a crossroads of divisiveness. 